Hello from Bucharest, the capital city of Romania. We'll be driving from the central part of it through the northwestern neighborhoods and then through the nice relaxing countryside west of the city until Rakari on the county road 601A. Let's go. We start in Bucharest, place Victoria, the seat of the Romanian government. Bucharest is the capital and largest city of Romania with a population of about 2 million inhabitants and it's, uh, it's a cultural, industrial and financial center. Bucharest is located in the south of uh, Romania, between the Carpathians and the Danube. It was first mentioned in documents in uh, 1459 and became the capital of Romania in 1862. Its architecture is a mix of historical, mostly eclectic, but also neoclassical and Art Nouveau, interbellum, Bauhaus, Art Deco and Romanian revival architecture, socialist era and modern. In the period between the two world wars, the city's elegant architecture and the way of life of its elite earned Bucharest the nickname Little Paris. Although buildings and districts in the historic center, uh, city center were heavily damaged or destroyed by war, earthquakes or the socialist program of systematization, some survived and have been renovated. During the recent years, the city experienced an economic and cultural boom, being one of the fastest growing high-tech cities in Europe. Since uh, 2019, Bucharest uh, hosts, uh, hosts the largest high-tech summit in Southeast uh, Europe, Romanian Blockchain Summit. More and more uh, tourists are coming to the city for the rich architectural heritage, the cultural and nightlife, uh, or for conventions and fairs. There are also many museums of national importance in the city. One can easily spend a full week here strolling through the beautiful streets, going to museums, concerts and festivals and tasting the local gastronomy. I personally lived uh, for eight years in Bucharest, studied here too and I return almost every year to the city as I still have many friends living here. Now we, were, we are driving through the northwestern neighborhoods of the city after crossing the imposing Basara Bridge. Through Julesht, we are finding our way out of the big city and are joining um, the county road 601A in the suburb of Kiasna. Soon uh, we are crossing the Bucharest bypass, leaving the metropolitan area of Bucharest and going into the countryside. There are still many villages on the way, but they don't look uh, urban anymore. We are following the Dumbovica River upstream and cross into Juju County before, be, between Dragomirești and Bucu. The road is of uh, good quality here and we are driving through Bucu, Joitsa and Kosoba. After Kosoba we enter Dumbovica County, our fourth administrative unit today, after Bucharest City, Ilfov and Juju counties. Dumbovica is a very beautiful county, stretching from the Carpathians to the South Romanian Plains. We are also explore, we are now exploring the flatter area in the south of it at altitudes between 110 and 130 meters. We find, find our way to our destination, Rakar, driving through Brezoia, Brezoia and Slobozia Moara, where we cross over the National Road 7. But uh, now enough talking and let's enjoy the very drive, first through Bucharest and then through the relaxing countryside west of the city. And I'll be back towards the end of the drive to say a few words about our destination, the small town of Rakari. Until then, just relax, sit back and enjoy the ride. <laughs>
Once again, hope you enjoyed the drive through Bucharest and the rural area west of it. We are now in Rakari, where we joined the National Road 71 that links Târgoviște with the National Road 7 in Bucharest. The town has a population of about 7,000 inhabitants <coughs> and lies about 40 kilometers northwest of Bucharest at an altitude of about 140 meters. It is a town uh, since uh, 2004 and is famous for uh, being the birthplace of uh, the writer Ion Gica who also erected some uh, buildings uh, during here during the second part of the 19th century. Now I finished uh, driving here in Rakari on the National Road 71. Hope you enjoyed the video and stay tuned for more videos from our road trips that will be shared here on the channel. Bye bye until the next time.